How are we going everybody? Just a quick one today regarding pruning trees. Now I've been harvesting my fruit, my plums, apricots, peaches and now starting the nectarines. Two weeks after you've harvested the fruit off your tree, it's time to give it a summer prune. Now, this all this upright growth that you see here, that's what we call summer prune. Now every tree has a slightly different shape and structure. You've got the open wine glass here, you've got the, the vase shape, you've got the spalliers, a pyramid and all sorts. Depending on the shape of the tree, organise yourself to prune it back. But for now the summertime prune is basically taking off all the summer growth back to arm's reach. Now you can prune up to there, I reckon shoulders reach or just above your head, something like that or even if that's still too high, take it right down. But we're talking two or three buds from the bottom, cut it all back. You may want to keep some of those branches because you're trying to restructure the tree, but generally the bulk of the summer growth needs to come down so that we can push some energy back into the roots and prepare it for spring. The later you leave it, the less likelihood you're going to get flowers in spring and an abundance of fruit. So prune early, summer prune, bring it down to the height you need to, then wait for winter when it goes dormant. And we'll talk about the ins and outs of pruning the tree during the dormant period where you can see better inside. Reduce the height, reduces the watering and reduces the stress on the root system. Check out our website, VasilisGarden.com. Our mid-year summer sale is ending tonight at midnight. Everything's been heavily discounted, so you can get all your favourite garden products from the one website. VasilisGarden.com. From me, Vasili, Maresi.